Welcome to the locker room. Coach Giggs here in today's message, Become More Tolerant of Others. Become more tolerant of others. Letting go of your habit of judging others for having maybe a different lifestyle than you do or different thoughts and opinions than you will lift a burden off of your shoulders. Dislike of another person can come from what your parents or the society in which we were raised in has taught us. You believed them, your parents or others, because you were too young to have any reason to disagree with them because you wanted to fit in. Now you're old enough to revisit your beliefs and those that were handed down to you to see if, in fact, they still hold true and make sense. I want to challenge you to challenge yourself to find holes in your intolerant beliefs of others and to become more open-minded to hearing the opinions of someone who has a different one than you. You'll probably find that the two of you have a lot more in common than you thought. As you work to become more tolerant and accepting of others and their beliefs, you will become smarter because you'll learn about the other ways of thinking and being and doing, and you'll become happier because you will no longer be walking around holding on to any of that anger. I found this true early in my life as I began to get to know Mr. Rappaport, the founder of our company. I was so young and so dumb, I didn't understand most of what he said and was trying to teach me. And So in the beginning, I was a lot less tolerant of his opinion. Well, that was because I didn't realize how wise and smart he was. But over time, thank God, I began to close my mouth and open my ears and become a lot more tolerant and understanding. And it changed my entire life. Remember, God gave you two ears and one mouth. I think the message is clear. We need to listen twice as much as we talk and become more tolerant of others. As you work to become more open-minded, you and me, of our friends who differ from us, people who differ in race, color, religion, political views, sexual orientation, This will enrich your life because you will become more understanding of others and less judgmental. And then guess what? You're going to live in a better world, one that's filled with less anger, less stress, more openness. You'll learn more. You'll see more than you could have ever thought possible, all because you became more tolerant of others. That's the message today, gang. Happy Friday. Have a wonderful weekend, and we'll see you on the next time. If you've enjoyed and feel that the Daily Locker Room has served as an inspiration in your life, why not take this moment and do the same for a friend by sending them the Daily Message? Click on the Tell a Friend tab, fill in their information, and help spread the inspiration.